That's oh. the highest standard I've ever heard. If a friend invites you to his place and cook for you... If they cooked you a dog, would you eat the dog? Here's five euros, cut this chicken's head off and turn them into chicken breasts for me, for my stir fry. Would you do it? Um. You know what this is? Uh, this is a chicken industry in England. Most of it, 95% of the birds here are factory farmed in the UK. When you, when you see a piece of chicken, yeah. you don't think of the uh, animal, do you? Yeah. No, they trick you. And you're a kind heart? Yeah, but I don't have time to cook vegetables. Wait, do you cook chicken? Yeah, but... How much time does it take to cook chicken? No, yeah, the, the fact is uh, I cook every day for me, so we complete okay. in the other side if I don't have the protein of the animal. Ah, so you don't know how to get protein. Okay, so, but you don't think this is good? No, obviously it's... Yeah, so if you don't think it's good, uh, wouldn't you try to find out if you can get protein from... Yeah, I think if I have much money and time, I maybe... You don't need much, you, the same amount of time it takes you to cook right now, it would take the same amount of time to cook a vegan meal. Yeah, but the time... It's not the, it's just the same amount of time. Because you have, if you do it a burger of uh, legumes, beans and, and all of that, you have to make that. No, you can get canned beans, canned chickpeas, you just open up the can and chuck them in. You can get a block of tofu, you just chop it up, fry it up the same, put flavour on there. I, I eat them too, but... So does it take you more time to cook tofu than it does to cook chicken? No, it's the same time, but... Okay, then. Yes, yes, but uh, the fact is like I don't have the money to pay this. It's too much, expensive. In Spain, it's more expensive. Yeah. Can you get vegan yes. meat there? Yes. Okay. Yes. okay. But it's expensive. Uh, are beans more expensive and than chicken? In, in Spain, it's not more con confidential. How much do you think it costs for the for the animals? No. More than it costs for you? Yes, and it contaminates so much. It's cruelty? Yes. It's, it's, uh, how much hard, it's hard for you to maybe change a little bit. How hard is it for the chickens? This it is the eggs. Be, this is eggs. I could be yeah. worse. Free range eggs here. Oof. They put 16,000 in the barn and they open up the barn every now and then to let them out. This is free range. Yes. Our friends, uh, work in an industry of that and he told me stories yeah. and I'm concerned but the fact is expensive, I don't have time to cook and maybe I go to a restaurant and I have noodles with chicken and yes I'm concerned but in the center ways you, I go You have a bad habit like everyone, no. yeah it's habit, it's habit you yeah, it's a bit, yeah, but I think uh, my nutrition is good. Because well, the, what, what, what's so nutritious about eating this? Eating dead animals? What, why do you think this is nutritious? animals, but... This is a dead animal that you eat. Yes, but I think the protein of the animals is good. Wait, would you eat the protein of a dog? No, but... In a, wait, 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 it's the same, same no, good? Yeah, it's yeah but in another country, the culture... No, no, you, I mean you. I want to I wanna know why you wouldn't. No, because I have a dog, I have a pet. And is it bad to eat a dog? Because I have... I don't see the... Killing. The pain of the animals. Yeah, you're disconnect. it's called a disconnect. So it happens behind closed doors. Yeah, so but if you had the chicken here, had the chicken here, and I gave you a knife, I said, kill this little chicken. No, because no, you need to because of protein. What did you say? Protein, nutrition, and no, expensive. No, but if I if I am in uh, Iceland, if you go if you go to an island and you are there with no food, you, you, you survival. You mean? Yes. Yeah, but you know you're not you're not surviving. <laughs> no, you're not yeah. a survivor. Yeah, yeah. But you're hunting. Where's your hunting stick? I, I'm surviving. You got a spear? Because I live alone in Granada studying and I'm a survivor because I don't have money to pay them. But, but vegetables, uh, but beans and rice and pasta and bread yeah. are the cheapest foods you can my, get. My, my meal, every day my meal is that, but I combine with protein of animals, but a little bit of protein. Uh, uh, so well, you, you mean their bodies? You put animals' bodies in your meal as well? 
So you, you can... Bodies? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Well, it's their body. Yeah, what is it? it? It's a body of a little... What, what animals do you eat? Just chickens? Yes, yeah, chickens. What about cows? Do you eat cows? Pigs? Spain is big with pigs. Yeah. You know how they kill pigs in Spain? Uh, electric. Oh, uh, electric. Okay. And uh, what do you think that's like for the pig? No, it's horrible. And yet they... When they get the knife in their throat and but the blood... I don't eat, uh, okay. Pigs. I yeah. only eat you eat little birds. Birds. Yeah. You know when the birds are killed, do you know how old they are? So little. About four to six weeks? Yeah. And little babies. They live for years and years. And they grow up with really fast. Water and like Yeah, that. because they grow and their full size in, in a month or something. Yeah. And they can't and just they put it at like uh, so much uh, eat to make them big and uh, antibiotic makes them big as well. It, it's sick, but maybe when I it's not sick enough for you to stop eating though. So it's it's you, you think it's sick, yes, right? But, but you eat you put it in your mouth. I like okay, let me just choose. If I got this chewing gum off the ground and put it, you'd be like, no way. <laughs> but you're eating like out of a this slaughterhouse with blood and scared animals, and and they they def they poo out there. They my, my daily routine is like a study, go to uni, yeah. uh, go na, 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 and I don't have time and cash to pay and do it. Do you know how many how many hours I work a day? It's selfish, but I have a, a lot of distractions, go to parties, yeah. go meet you know, people, and then when I go home, I'm so tired to think about where's yeah. my new menu. It's Maybe. easy. It's much easier when you think of the animal. Yeah, yeah, I, yeah. Because you wouldn't eat a pe you wouldn't eat people. You wouldn't eat a dog. You just wouldn't. You wouldn't care if you didn't have the time. You would make sure you didn't choose the dog at the supermarket. Even if it was like not eating dog was a little bit more expensive, you'd be like, maybe I won't buy that thing that I want, and uh, I don't want to eat the dog. Yeah. You know that that's a rule that you would have. Uh, it's a fact like uh, the humans are omnivorous. You think you're a, you think you're naturally like a a violent omnivorous. animal, like a we are omnivorous, but like a bear. There is like a lot of damage with the animals. So if you're an omnivore, why do you have a problem with killing dogs and eating them? Omnivores. No, you you have um, if you yeah. if you are a survivor, you have to. Yeah. What if I'm not trying to survive? Like what? If I'm, if I'm an omnivore, right, why do you have a problem with being harming animals? Because omnivores don't think like Peru, that. People in Peru eat pig nuts. Yeah, I'm just saying like a, a natural omnivore, like a bear. You eat a fish? A bear or a dog. If they rip up an animal, they don't feel bad. But we feel bad. Why? We don't have the claws. We don't have instinct. Because if you see I, a pigeon... I'm close with my dog and I see yeah. a dog more friendly, um, maybe. But if you see I, a pigeon, right? A, a cat, like a, or an omnivore, animal, they're jumping on this pigeon. If you see a pigeon, you don't think, I'm going to rip their throat out, eat them. Most omnivores, all omnivores and carnivores, they eat their animals, the blood's still pumping in their throat. They, they bite into their veins and they chew on their head and their skull and their cartilage and their bones. You go to the supermarket and you get a wrapped piece of um, animal already killed and you put it on a, on a uh, stove and you yeah, cook it. Yeah. This is an omnivore. No, this is not omnivore, but... Do you think you'll be healthy without meat? Yes. Yeah. But it's healthier too if you have an ecologic farm and you have your... Uh, that, you know how expensive that is? <laughs> yeah, but... You said it's too expensive. <laughs> no, 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 wait, wait, wait. It's yeah, much more expensive. Yeah, but it's a utopia. So why don't you just be vegan, you know? You just said uh, you, don't, you, won't, you won't be vegan because it's too expensive. Yeah, but, but these it, ecological it farms. If you have an ecological farm, you no. will eat the birds. No way. No. If if you are happy, I don't want to kill you if you're happy. <laughs> uh, if I have a if I have birds, I'm gonna uh, help them and look very, after them. We have a culture, a uh, very far cultural. It's like killing uh, cows. I know. In and the bullfighting. Yes. Yeah, that's evil. Yes, that's it's terrible. Evil. I'm so. You're against it? Yeah. You support something that's way worse. Because that's uh, spectacular and I don't like You don't it. like it? Yeah, I get what you mean, but if you're against bullfighting, you're against bullfighting. That's one animal being tortured and killed, right? When you eat chickens, how many chickens do you eat a year? A lot. 
And that's a hundred animals tortured and killed. It's a, it's a lot more harm to in individuals than I, bullfighting. I know what you mean, but it's complicated to me to put that of it. It's really simple. Yeah, but you so making it know. complicated and making in your mind, you, this is what I believe, because I've been doing this for a long time. There's, there's people who accept the reality and try to change, or there's people who don't want to accept it and want to hold on to a habit. Eating meat is something you've always done. You like the taste. You know, um, you don't want to be inconvenienced. I don't like the taste too yeah. much. You don't like the taste of chicken? No. Then why do you, why do you eat it? <laughs> I don't know, because I don't have time to. Because it's easy. Think about it. It's easy for yeah. you. So wait, if you, had, uh, if you had resources, someone helping you. Yes. If I have a chef in my house. <laughs> a chef? I, <laughs> I truly. <laughs> What do you want? You, you like, so I'm vegan, like totally vegan, <laughs> but I don't have time. You, you will only go vegan and stop killing animals if you have a personal chef. <laughs> yes, that selfish. is your standard. It's selfish. It's selfish. That's the most, that's oh, the highest yeah. standard I've ever heard. Yeah. <laughs> but seriously, selfish. you cook your own food at home anyway. And you, it doesn't take any longer to cook a meal without meat. Yeah, I, I, I know. But so you just remove the meat, add some more beans, add some tofu, add some... Tofu's not expensive. No. Tofu's beans. not... And you can crisp make... I hate when people don't put flavour on their tofu. Yeah. You don't eat raw chicken. So just... You make it crispy, fry it with oil and put hoisin or soya sauce or something, make it really nice. It's you the same amount of time. You are hungry. You're angry from me. Sorry? You are angry. I'm angry. No, 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 not angry. Not angry. No, no. You don't have to be sorry yeah, I to me. To conserve me, but only for the chickens. I'm sad. Yeah. Only for the chickens. Because you and I, we can talk about. Um, if we have a problem, we can talk about it. If someone hurts you, you can call the police. Yeah. But no one's going to help the chickens. Yeah, I'm so. It's a I'm vegan challenge. <laughs> I definitely understand you, your point, but human beings can only defend the animals. They can't defend themselves. So they're, they're very innocent. A little chicken can't do anything if you hurt them. No. When you go to the supermarket and you go, I'm going to give you this money for this chicken. You have to think, yeah, make the connection. So cruel. You have to think, oh my, I would never do this to a chicken. Yeah. If you did this to a chicken right here, everyone would try to stop you. And they'd all be hypocrites because they all pay for it as well. But, but I mean, like in Spain, cool weather, the, we ha I have so many barbecues and things like that, social, social... I come from Australia, a barbecue is the biggest part of Australian culture. Yeah. I don't care. Yeah, I will not, uh, if it's dogs on the barbecue, I'm not eating it, you know? If a uh, friend invites you to his place and cook for you, our family, and you... If they cooked you a dog, would you eat the dog? <laughs> uh, but social pressure, you know. Yes, I. You wouldn't I eat the dog. You would eat the dog. No. Come on, you wouldn't eat the. I you eat, wouldn't eat I, the dog. I ate kangaroo. <laughs> you ate a kangaroo. Yeah. Come I on. Ate <laughs> yeah, but if the can okay. Trial. But if the kangaroo was here and they were like, "Hey, what's up?" You wouldn't stab them, gut them, no. and eat them. Yeah, because you don't have to do it. But I, in a, with a fish, don't. Yeah, yeah. No. you wouldn't kill them yourself. No. So would you pay me to kill them? Yes. You would pay me to kill but them? You know uh, another person. Yeah, yeah, but say, like me right now, if there's a, there's a, what, a chicken here, let's call the chicken Charlie the chicken, Charlie the chicken, and they're little blue eyes, chickens have blue eyes, and they're just here pecking around. Hey, hello, what's your name? Blanca. Blanca? Hello, Blanca, how are you? And you're like, you know what, uh, nutrition, protein, uh, it's too expensive, I can't be bothered thinking about it, I need a personal chef. Joey, <laughs> can you pay, here's, here's five, how much is chicken? Five euros? Here's five euros, cut this chicken's head off and turn them into chicken breasts for me, for my stir fry. Would you do it? Um, no, I don't pay. But you pay, this is what happens all the time, every yes. time in the supermarket. That's how I think of it. Makes sense. <laughs> Thanks Sorry. for talking to me. <laughs> Do the vegan challenge. Take care. Well, a personal chef is the standard now. I just, I just didn't get that. Like how it takes the same amount of time to cook a piece of tofu. The, the, the price argument, I, you know, maybe a, you get a Beyond Burger and a beef burger, a cheap beef burger. Maybe, yeah, Beyond Burger is going to be more expensive. But then there's so many cheap vegan foods that you're saving so much money anyway. 
Is that a gate? I don't get it. 